Hello. Hello. Welcome back to our channel, Linday Ansi. So guys, we'll ask Roger why she wants to stay here in the Philippines. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hey, hey. <laughs> why? Um, well, I want to be with you, and I love it. I love the Philippines. I mean, I mean, look where we are now. It, it's really nice here, sitting here in a park, and then, also, and also, I'm with you. That's it. Hmm? That's it. That's it. Yeah, and also, it's <laughs> expensive to live in UK. Yes, it is. It's it's become very expensive to live in the UK now as well. But most importantly, I'm with you. We are here in Jamal Cebu, guys, and we will share you about the extension visa for foreigners. Before, we will share our experience, guys, of extension visa. So we will eat first in snack yard, the best nachos there. Hello guys! So, nakauwi na po kami guys galing ng immigration at i-share ko po sa inyo guys yung extension visa po ng fiancé ko po. Tapos, yung binigay lang po nila is one month extension visa. So, ang requirements lang po ay passport. Passport po. Tapos, um mag-fill up ka po ng form. So, ito po yung form na ibigay ng immigration or pwede po i-download nyo sa bahay nyo para ma-fill up pa nyo. Pagdating doon, ready na. So, it's just uh, takes uh, about 30 minutes there waiting. So, it's not too bad guys. ba? So, yun po. Uh, Naka-extend po siya until June. 17, 2022. So, one month lang po yung extension, guys. At ito po yung nabayaran niya. 2,030 pesos for one month extension here in the Philippines. So, guys, um, madali lang po, guys, pumunta lang kayo sa Bureau of Immigration kung saan kayo malapit. Tapos, mag-extend lang kayo doon. Um, ang dali lang po. Kaya, yun po guys. God bless. Bye-bye.